Hey guys, happy Friday. Let's get started again with a little video. Let me clear up my phone real good, a little budgeting video. So let's do our update from last week. So what is this? Today is what? June 28th, right? My goal for the end of the year goal is 10K. So I'm at a 7K goal. Um, in a few days, it'll be July 1st. Y'all know that's bills and stuff. So today I paid the car insurance. I'm gonna just put the INS for car insurance about 120. I think it was about 120 or $130. Uh, July 1st, I do not have to pay rent, right, guys? Because I get that blessing for a few time, a few times where I won't have to pay rent until like September or something. So that's that's uh, my rent is 1,100. I don't really get um, assistance or help at all. I don't get food stamps or nothing. So I'm about to go get some food. Okay, so let's go ahead and put the food budget. 150. Phone. My phone bill, I get Xfinity, so we got a deal with me and grandma. We got the Xfinity deal for about $35, $33. So then it's 1100 through the month of July or today, just because today's Friday. That means that you can, at least you don't have to save 1100 but you can save 1000 because that's not going towards your rent. So to be honest, what's today? June 28th. You can save that thousand and get to an eight thousand goal. I'm just going to put in some um, possible possibilities, right? Possibilities. You can hit an eight k goal and then end up doing other things. But guys, next week is July fourth, so happy Independence, right? You might want to pop fireworks or something. I don't pop fireworks. We just want to be safe. I don't. We don't really know how to do that. So what we're going to do is watch them. And you can either get a little sparkle or something, and that'll be something cool to do. But the possibilities of things that I could do, I could just go ahead and uh, mess around, save the 500. You only have to do um, a whole 1K, just save 500. And then by the time July come around, I'll be at 7,500 goal. Let me talk about some other goals for this year as well. Um, I need about 93 subs. And then I'll be at 4K. The goal by December is 5K subs. So again, at the end of the year, my goal was $10,000. But I'm almost at, I was thinking maybe do like 8,000 or 7,500. But I am at 7,000. 7,000 is really good. I know it's not a lot of money or something to others. But it's something to me and I'm grateful and I thank God for that. Keep on moving on. When you don't have to um, pay certain bills, be responsible. And, and write down like a budget and stuff. When I go to the store, okay, I might do um i'm going to do um grocery budgets but for food i got i gotta pay i gotta use my debit card to pay for food right so i'm thinking about 100 50 200 budget and then whatever you know the needs of the house is um you know food the toiletries or whatever little snacks and then the phone already covered car insurance already covered i did that right so you can just basically cross that out of your mind and then the rest of the money um i did do a um clothes haul i did spend a hundred something dollars on clothes excuse me and then I um, I don't need any shoes or nothing, but I know that July 4th coming up, right? So you know for sure um, when I go out the door today, I'm going to be getting some things to put on the, the grill. We have a, a smokeless indoor grill. So certain foods for that. Um, I think I'm going to go. I'm going to do a little trip. I'm going to go to Michigan, and I'm going to spend the 4th in Michigan, right? The 4th. Um, I'm also off on the 5th. So that's a little something that I could do, something that I'm thinking of as well. So again, the goal for the end of the year is 5K subs by December, and I'm almost at 4K subs. So that's not as realistic because if I'm almost at 4K, then that means, um, if I'm almost at 4K, then that means that um, by December, like for some reason, that's like five months, I'm going to have more subbies by then. I'm already claiming that. So that's really interesting. And then the money goal, always save a little. I don't care if you can't save a thousand dollars, even if I had to pay rent and stuff, like eventually in August, I'm going to have to pay rent. So I, um, I'm going to have to, uh, save only about 300, $400 guys. And that's fine. Or maybe 600 or something here and there, because you got to, you know, pay your bills like the car, my car, I pay $300 and then other things as well. And then, uh, you know, food and stuff. And then if you want clothes and things like that. So, yeah, life expensive. But like I'm saying, if you can save five, ten dollars $10, go ahead and do that. Okay, thanks, guys. Have a great day. Happy Friday. Bye.